Module 16, study guide problems 3 and 4. 3, which is the solution? So you should have rewritten that. 4x minus y equals 8 and 6x plus y equals 2. Um, you should notice that these y's are opposites. So you can simply add these equations together. So you get 10x equals 10 divided by 10 and x equals 1. So which of these has x equaling 1? We actually don't need to do any more work because only one of these has x equaling 1, but let's um, plug it in. So 6x plus y equals 2 6 times 1 plus y equals 2, 6 plus y equals 2, minus 6 on both sides, and y equals negative 4. So x equals 1, y equals negative 4, the answer to 3 is b. Which set of numbers is ordered from least to greatest? Now this might look scary, but don't panic. Um, we have 2 pi square root of 7 and 2.6. Well, pi is 3.14, so 2 times 3.14 gives us 6-something. So 2 pi is 6.28-something. Uh, and then we have 2.66 repeating, and then we have the square root of 7, which is between 2 and 3. So the square root of 7... Square root of 7 is between 2 and 3. So uh, the easiest way to look at this is to say that 2 pi is definitely the biggest. And since we're ordering them from least to greatest, we know that 2 pi needs to go at the end. So which of these answers has 2 pi at the end? The answer to 4 is B.